let's just talk about Ernest Borgnine, a true legend in Hollywood. The Oscar winner always said he had the best job in the world being an actor. He passed away on Sunday. ABC's David Wright has a celebration of his life. His tour of duty as the skipper of the PT-73 made him a household name. Well, this is uh, uh, Chief uh, Lilolani. Nani. Nani. But Ernest Borgnine was a serious actor long before he was a TV star. In 1955, Grace Kelly presented the Oscar. Ernest Borgnine in Martin. Money, put on the blue suit, huh? Blue suit, gray suit. I'm just a fat little man, a fat, ugly man. You're not ugly. I'm ugly. I'm ugly. I'm ugly. Come on, leave me alone. Borgnine bet Jerry Lewis a buck ninety-eight he would not win the Oscar, but stuck a hundred and ninety-eight pennies in a red sock of his daughter's just in case. Jerry Lewis was at the thing there to help me up on the stage, you know. And I handed him the red sock. <laughs> I said, okay, you win. And I walked up and got my Oscar. Borgnine was always the gruff but likable guy. That's him in the Dirty Dozen and the Poseidon Adventure. What makes you so damn sure about everything? He worked long after many of his peers had retired or died. I, I never gave up. I said, hey, I've got the best job in the world. At age 92, nominated for an Emmy for his role on the last episode of ER. I believe that as an actor, your, your imagination is what works. This is why we're actors. Imagination works. Ernest Borgnine was 95.